Welcome to vlog two, everybody. Vlog one is actually exporting right now, and it's actually pretty decent. Um, it's shorter, it's about 10 minutes, 18 seconds. It's exporting, by the way. Premiere did an update. It's fantastic. Congratulations, Premiere, you did something good. Good job. Yeah, I mean, it's great. You guys did great on it. I can actually widescreen to my MacBook now. The whole interface is ten times better. So good job for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm going to be downstairs today probably again. Cleaning and organizing some more. I'm going to go down a little earlier than noon. I went down a little late yesterday. <laughs> probably go down here in a bit. Probably in a couple minutes. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna vlog it. Um, the vlog is pretty decent. I've added some graphics in there, some cool little things. I'm gonna try to have some fun today. I'm gonna try to work on making my new intro for my YouTube videos, but I gotta get, I don't know how that's gonna work just yet, but we're gonna head downstairs in a bit. When the vlog is exported, when that's done, then I will upload it and we'll be on our way. Vlogs exporting now. Alright, so I bought a toy for Shelly. <laughs> <laughs> You're not that close There's to nothing me. on it. Um, basically, we went to Hobby Lobby to get stuff to fix the base, right, for the Christmas show that's next week. Next week. It was only $22, so I bought a Dremel tool, but um, it was probably a bad idea. But we're going to try to fix the base. The bridge is broken. But how does this work? That's what I want to know. Should I read the destructions first? Hmm. That's probably what I should do. How does this work? Oh, there's different speed settings. Oh, that's cool. Anyway, I bought this like Dremel tool so we can fix the bridge of the base. Um, it's got all kinds of different things in it, but I don't know how it works. This is honestly kind of a pain if you think about it. All right, Shell. I said boom, 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 boom. You know what we need to do? You need to go through your Funko Pops and pick out the ones you absolutely pick out the oh pick out God. the ones you absolutely want on the wall, and we can put them on the wall. Oh yeah, Shelly, this will be perfect. Oh, Shalita. Shalita, yeah. And then it gives you this little doomer hickey that you can put on the end of it. So then if you want to get like we real... We mounted your TV on that. Which I think is what I'm going to do is I'm going to hang it, a boom arm up here, and then have this on it so then I can just bring it down here and do my little dremlin. I'm a dremlin gremlin. Anyways, so this is Shell. Basically, we're trying to fix the base, all right? Because it's like, if you watched the vlog I posted yesterday, you would see. Anyway, so yeah, I got the Dremel. Got the Dremel. Um, got the Edit Bay from yesterday. Edit Bay from yesterday. Um, um, I don't reckon to know what we're going to do here. I think... Basically, we're just going to try to fix the base with the Dremel. We're going to do that while I clean. Where is the cutting wheel? The whole reason I bought the damn thing. Oh, there's 20. Oh, this is them. There's 20 of them. Okay, so... Oh, son of a... All this in here. Probably not. I think I can get it pre Alright, everybody. So, quick update. Shelly's making more of a mess than there was when he got here. That's fine, though. Because this room is becoming more cleaner. So, you guys can see there's some walk-in space in here. Clean, like the tre the treadmill needs to go somewhere. It's basically, it's never going to be clean is really the bottom premise. <laughs> so, Shammy's making a mess. I can smell it now. I, I'm watching the Christmas show and drilling and making a mess. I'm going to show you a little thing I'm really proud of. So, I took the little Dremel, right, and I put it on a boom arm. So then I can move it around wherever I need it to go. So, like, let's say there's something down here I need to work on. I just take this and I dangle it over here. And then this can reach farther down. And then I can just move this thing around to where it needs to go. And I can reach the power and get to what I need to get to. I reckon that's pretty cool. Um, so, currently I'm trying to fix Ooh, the bridge. They take board games too, right? They take board games too, right? So yeah, I'm just trying to fix this base. 
so we can use it for the Christmas special that is currently being planned already. I'm so excited to be able to cut things and stuff now. Another thing I'm really excited about is the fact that I can pre-drill screw holes. So then if I need to screw something together, I can pre-drill some screw holes. But yeah, and then I can like it pull on it and it'll come to me. I did get it wired up. Really cool wired up. So it runs off this little skid about, okay? And it runs up here, right yonder. It goes down yonder, back down there to an extension cord. That runs back here and plugs in right there. So it's not like it's in the way. I'm also making a mess, destroying the space even more than it was when I got it. And, um, having a good time. Okay, give me just a minute. Una minuta. All right. He is not coming back to Chelsea. He is indeed coming back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we've actually got a marvel in the newsroom. We're watching Channel 17 News. That's the doctor of Channel 17 News. All right, we've got a marvel in the newsroom. We are actually doing a lot of moving right now. This might be a two-day event. Here's what's about to happen. So you guys know the big room. This is the big room. We obviously refer to it a lot of times. This is the big room. That's the small room. That's what it usually is referred to as. Here's the thing. Way back yonder to the Christmas comeback special era, this used to be my room. Okay, right over yonder? Over yonder? Yeah, that used to be my room. All my stuff was in there. Then I got too much stuff. It all got moved in here. I condensed it into this husky thing, and now there's like, I don't have as much. Right? Anyway. Also, this is going to give us a chance to go through that crap. Anyway, what we're about to do is a crazy thing. We're moving all of my stuff back into that little room. And, and what I mean by my stuff is all my camera stuff. So my Husky toolbox and my shelf. That's going back into that room so then I can have like a dedicated recording room. Because I don't need a lot of room for that. And this room is going to be my drums, arcade machines, everything that's not film related. And that room is where I'll be able to film, keep all my stuff, put my edit bay in there, and, and... You guys know that this room has the warm lights, this has the cool lights. Here is really just a great marvel. This is a marvel in the newsroom here. I actually have the two light bulbs in there. I can change this, and I can change the colors. Using these lights I got at Target. So now when we do the Christmas show, or any sort of video, I can change the color of these, use my fill light to make myself, right, white, normal color, and then this will change the ambiance, so then I can do whatever. And there are two different ones that I can change the color separately. So for the Christmas show, they can be red and green. For Channel 17, they can be blue and red. The thing is, they're so close together, it's really hard to change the color separately. So I don't know how that's going to work. And I have the remote to control them on and off, so... Yeah, pretty much everything is going to go in the smaller room. Oops. Going to go in the smaller room. Oh, great, Shelly, look. They're going back and forth now. Oh, yeah, they won't go together. Fantastic. Well, now what? Uh-oh. Why aren't they changing together? You're screwed. Hey, Shelly, how do I do this? I, yeah, I don't even know, because with mine, mine does the same thing. Uh-oh. Anyway, that's what's about to go down. A lot, a lot of work. Um, but we're gonna get it done. It's 3.35 right now. Hopefully we'll have it done by 3.34. Um, he's fixing those lights. But that's what's gonna happen. All of the camera stuff is going into the little room. Um, and then we're gonna be able to film in there. Um, cause see, I'm not trying to do a big huge set. And then for filming Channel 17, it can go in there. Christmas show can be done in here. All right, do you wanna help me move this? Uh, no. Anyway, we got a lot of work to do. A lot of, a lot of work to do. I'll check in with you when it gets done. Probably about four months from now. Alright guys, we're about to move the big, big daddy, the husky toolbox in this room. It's gonna go on this wall here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna shimmy it through the doorway. It's gonna park right here, right yonder. That's gonna slide out, that's gonna go in yonder. Actually, no, there's another dresser right over there. That's gonna have to go first, but it's heavier than my garden. Yeah, wow. All right, vloggers. All right, pick up that side. This is the mess we're working with now. 
Yeah, pick up that side. That's gotta go jogger. How are you gonna rotate? Oh, I know how you're gonna rotate. Come on. How are we gonna rotate? Well, we gotta we get that out of here it. first. We gotta get this out. <clears throat> Alright. So, it's been probably three hours since I last talked to you. So we're back in this ugly room of lighting. Here is what has been done so far. So you guys remember this small room, that's the big room, and here, I'm in the small room. This was supposed to be the studio. It's not. All of this stuff was taken out of the room, crammed into this mess, and all of the, my camera stuff was brought in here. Then, things didn't turn out like they were supposed to. I didn't reckon them to end that way. So, uh, they ended that way. Then Mason left. I ate dinner. It's about 6.30 now. And I've cleaned the room. Um, a lot has been cleaned in the small room, though. This room was a mess. And there's still some that has to come in here, but it's honestly really well cleaned now. Like, that's decently organized. This wall here is decently organized. Honestly, the entire room is pretty well done now. This room is still a disaster. I still have to clean this. I put the camera stuff back, and then a lot of this still has to be organized. A lot of this is suitcases and stuff like that that's gonna have to go in here somewhere. But we're gonna get that figured out. I just figured I'd check in with you before I continued the mess. Okay, so it's like eight o'clock, no. Nine o'clock. Read my clock wrong, sorry. This is what the room has turned out to be now. You guys can see it looks really cluttered. In person, it's a lot different. The carpets, it looks different in person than it does here. Because, like, you can actually see around things with your eyeballs. It's not as bad as it looks on camera. It's really not, okay? It's a lot more organized than it was. I'll say that. Anyway, this room is becoming less and less cluttered. The trash pile is growing increasingly large. The desk edit bay area is become, coming along. Um, one of the things is, th now that the clothing rack is in there, the edit bay is against the wall, and I can use this for more storage of stuff. So, that's working. That area is getting cleaned up. The music section's almost done. I just need to take care of this. And I think after that, this could be probably the cleanest this basement's been. And actually my project that was supposed to take place this summer is being done way quicker. The whole entire project was to throw away things I didn't need anymore. And that's what's really being done and to organize things. And look how organized it already is. So it's, it's going along great and getting there a lot quicker than I thought it was going to. All right, so this is what we're left with for tonight. It's not that bad. It's really, like if you look at it from here, in here is okay. This room is getting slightly more clutter. It's getting there, it's okay. But this section, it's really just this bit here and a lot of this is just my scooter and chairs, plus a base. Trash pile's growing. It's good though, we'll get that taken care of. Overflow camera, large stuff. For what I've been able to get done today, I would say that I'm pretty excited for where we are. I said I was only gonna be down here for 30 more minutes. It's 8.30. Vlog two is gonna be over shortly. Um, so I can edit this in the morning, come back down here in the afternoon, finish up but I would say dolly aside where we got today in the in the matter of fact that all of this camera stuff all of this was in that room and everything that's in that room was in this room since about two o'clock today so in the matter of two to three three to four four to five five to six six seven in the matter of six hours I was able to take this whole room, put it in the small room, 
take everything in the small room, put it in this room, switch, basically switch the rooms, switch them back in six hours and be almost completely done and done better, mind you. So I would say, and, and most of this was moved by myself. The original swap was was all Mason. I, w I would almost say that every bit. Hey, am I able to? You guys are currently being rested on a uh, treadmill. The whoops. The first big movement of stuff was done by Mason. So like that would be all of the camera stuff into this room and all of the, this room back to there. That was all Mason mostly. I, I obviously helped. But a majority of the first swap was Mason. But after Mason left, I was able to take all of that, move it back into here, clean it up, organize it, and throw more stuff away, plus move that whole section back and get the entire gear area set back up. So I would say I, may, I did quite a bit. I was able to move it all on my own. Um, I'm going to go shower. That's it.